Hi, in this video, I'm going to show you how to use the InnoVista animated bubble chart as a Power BI custom visual. This component was generated automatically in the InnoVista animator and exported so that it can be deployed in Power BI. The visual allows a designer to present moving bubbles or images as they progress through the data, typically time periods. Both bubbles and images dynamically resize to represent new values. A user can pulse or browse through each individual time period. Here are two examples with data sources containing over 100 years of data. The first is the National Health, Wealth and Population Values and the second Olympic Medal History. Let's look at the data that we will use. In this case, values are based on Excel columns, but could just as easily come from any supported source. There are values for the period, X, Y and bubble items as well as the identifier and group. If we are going to show images instead of bubbles in the chart, we have two options. We can use a column of URLs pointing to SVG images or we can use a column of those images converted to Base64 data. We may want to use Base64 to avoid any external URL calls, but it will also mean quicker access to the images. There are many websites available that will convert SVG text to Base64. In this example, we have the URLs as a column in the data but the base64 in a second table linked by the country name. Open Power BI Desktop or online and the first step is to load the data. Here we open the Excel file and select two tables, one being the base data for the chart and the other being the base64 table. In some cases, we may need to create a link, but here as the column names are the same, Power BI will do it for us. Now we can import the animated bubble chart. On the Visualization tab, select the three dots to either import the visual from a file or from app source. Here we will import from the file system. Then click on the new visual icon to load it onto the canvas and resize. The visual will be a stock image until data are loaded. To link the data to the visual, we drag the data item in the Fields tab to the equivalent field in the visual. I will start by dragging year to chart periods. In this case, we don't want summary information. We want to use each row of data. So click the down arrow next to the visual field and select Don't Summarize. We will do this for each data item where relevant. Note that if you do not want the image to animate during setup, open the Format tab. Find the Run Animation option, open it and set it to Off. Don't forget to set this back to On when ready. Having completed the data linking, we can try the animation. Go back to Run Animation and Set to On. This should start the animation. Here, note that we are using bubbles and that they are skewed to the left-hand side. We have quite a number of options we can use in the Format section to help us make the visual more meaningful. But first, if we only want to show bubbles, we can leave the image URLs and image data fields empty. If we want to show images, we can use either of these two fields. If we are using URLs, drag the URL data to the URL field, or if we are using base64 data, drag the image data to the image data field. In format, we have a large number of options we can use to change the appearance of the chart. To improve this chart, let's set the x-axis to a log rather than linear scale. And then make the bubbles a bigger size. This we can do in the bubble size option.
Let's also set a minimum point for the x and y axis. We also want to set the labels, font size and color for the axis. This is of course done in the format section. There are also options for sorting, the duration of the animation effects, the period indicator, number formats and chart margins. Once we have completed those edits and have updated x-axis options, Reset the run animation and we can see how that has affected the appearance of the chart. Thank you for watching. If you would like to find out how to create your own Power BI animated visuals, please check the links below or search for InnoVista Animator in YouTube.